Boys have all kinds of activities for the kids. So bring the whole family down to Middletown. And here you can even get clothes for Barbie. That's what they have here, right? All right, good job. Doll clothes. You can buy anything here in Middletown today. And they've got some living history displays here. And these folks actually cooked up some vittles on an open fire here. That looks like sauerkraut. Absolutely. And this is the only way to learn about history, is to see it alive. Or if you have soft ground, for instance. Correct. Soft ground, they would bury it. So it just, it would just, like in Gettysburg, that was one problem at Gettysburg. It was, they were firing and it just stick in the ground, bury itself in the ground and become inert almost. It would explode under the ground, but it didn't do any damage. And that was a problem. Wood is called a practice plant, but in that cog would have been a piece of flint. What's flint? But what is flint? Stone. It's a piece of rock, right? Okay. And if you've ever, have you ever taken flint and struck it against steel? What do you get? Our sparks. It's kind of a cool day here in Middletown, so I'm sure that fire comes in handy. It is pretty nice, yeah. isn't it? All day long. So you didn't have candles. Did you have light? Oh, you didn't have a light switch. And Middletown is full of history, full of history everywhere you look. And is it soft? Are the pieces soldered together? Mm -hmm. Tin work? Is it well, it depends. So they've well, even got a tin smith here. On what you're doing here is washing the cup down. This is so good. So my over this machine is drilling, and that machine called a bar folder. I take the edge and take the roughness out or the, the sharpness. Sharpness. Another process, instead of just capping the bottom one like so, moving fast. That is moving very quickly. He made it. Alpaca. Beautiful. They have a uh, beautiful stuff. Rich, hold on a minute. I want to say hi to Bob. Very soft, very soft. <laughs> and they're having some fun here at the uh, Michelle Salon, right? Michelle Salon in Middletown. Wave, everybody. So they're going to actually fire the gun. So we're going to try it again. Whoops. Could it be the dampness officer? Could that no, have something to do with it? It's just primers are sometimes temperamental and don't always work. Okay. Or it could be the round is not seated properly. It could be lots of things. And you can see the supply wagon is back behind. There's the gun and the gunnery crew team. I don't I guess they call them. Wow. <laughs> wow. Woo! Oh, it went off that time. They're getting ready to fire this gun again. They're in the loading mode. Aiming it. <laughs> they have an exact procedure because this is literally playing with fire and these guys can get hurt very badly or killed if they don't do this exactly right. Wow. 
We're still here in Middletown at the Heritage Day Festival and she just learned how to ride the Segway. <laughs> Brand new rider. She's navigating the crowds. You can see how pedestrian friendly these units are. And that's it. We just lost another Segway. It's gone. Lean back, lean back, lean back. Oh, yeah, you really took off there. Go ahead, nice and easy. Go on over towards your friends. And again, we're still here in Middletown, and these are the gentlemen that were kind enough to demonstrate this fine piece of artillery. Is that what you call it? Right. Artillery. It's absolutely beautiful. Here we go, a new rock. And as we say goodbye to Middletown for the day, we say hello to this beautiful home here in Middletown. And you can see why it's such a popular place to live with architecture like this.